know yoga. It's medically proven to reduce stress, try to restore a little calm in our lives, right? But hey, it's difficult to find time to work it into our day, especially at work. Especially on a Monday. Never fear, though. Holly Mosier, author of Stress Less, Way Less, says you can do yoga at your desk at work, and it only takes three minutes huh. to get the benefits. Can you believe that? Kim Covington joins us live from the ninth floor newsroom for a quick demo. Are you already less stressed? Kim? Oh, she is amazing. I want you to look at Holly Mosier's arms, first of all. She's 50 one years old and I want to look like you girlfriend oh you're so sweet. and she came up here to our newsroom where we are suffering from a lot of stress girlfriend oh, yeah. so <laughs> please show us how to relieve it you have some sequences that you said are very easy yes I do um, what I like to do in the office is about a three-minute yoga sequence but we're gonna do it in a certain order we want to start with an inversion which means your head below your heart we move from there into a back bend and then we finish up with a twist to each side. And the viewers can do it with us along at home. You can do this in your office chair, in an airplane seat, or whatever you want to do with it. But Okay, you let's, let's see. You want to see it. Okay. All right, so we're going to start with our inversion. Okay. So the first thing you want to do is have proper seating position. Okay. It means that we typically dump into our uh, lower back. So bring I'm guilty of that sometimes. So am I. Yeah. So am I. So you bring your hands to your hip bones, lift up through the spine. Now okay. your hands should be level with the seat of your chair. That's where you want to start. That's proper seated position. Okay, now from there we're going to fold forward for our inversion. So first you inhale to extend through the spine, okay. and then you exhale, you start to fold forward from the hips. Draw the heart and chest a little bit forward. Let your hands just hang. Now inhale to extend, exhale to go ahead, and now just allow the head to go ahead and drop. Now the head is below the heart. We wanna stay here for a few breaths. You're gonna breathe in through the nose to the count of four, exhaling through the nose to the count of four. Let's take one more breath here. Inhale to the count of four, and exhale to the count of four. Now, on your next inhale, slowly roll up. Make sure you come up slowly. You just got a blood rush, but you should start to feel more relaxed already. How are you feeling? I, I'm feeling great. I know. Okay. I hope the viewers are doing this with us. You have one more. I've got, well, scoot forward for the back bend. Okay. Place the hands behind you. Now, shoot your elbows behind you. Want to inhale to extend, exhale to arch back, inhale to extend, exhale to arch back. Another breath here. And as you draw your elbows back, you'll feel that stretch and opening across the chest. It's a mood elevator. Now exhale and come back to seated. And then we finish up with a twist on either side. So you come back to your seat. And then we're going to twist to the right. This is going to look like the left to the viewers, but we're okay. going to the right. So inhale to extend. Exhale to twist. Keep your sit bones planted because you want the twist to come from the spine. Inhaling to extend. Exhaling to twist. And when you've reached your maximum, you should feel this stretch, but not pain. Take another deep breath here. On your exhale, come back to center. That feels so good. Doesn't it? Now we're gonna go the other side. Inhale to extend, exhale to twist. Inhale to extend, exhale, twist a little bit more. One more time, inhale to extend. Oh, they're doing it too with us. Are they? Oh, good. <laughs> exhale to twist. Remain okay. here for a breath or two. Now, come back to the center. If you're at home, wherever you are, you can hold those positions longer. There's no harm, but you want to slowly go into them and slowly come out. I am so encouraged because besides being a, a yoga instructor, she, you're, you're, you're 51. I cannot believe she's 51. She's a trial attorney and a mom. And you said when you were 39, you were overweight. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Well, crash and burn. I was overweight, gaining weight, losing energy, and I was completely depleted. And now I feel like like I did when I was a 12 year old girl. And I looked at her book. She's got a six pack now. I am working, and this is from yoga, and I am I'm gonna be doing this. I'm gonna be doing this at my desk, everywhere, on the bus, everywhere, at home, <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> You'll enjoy your day so much more. You can do this multiple times a day, and I think you should. It's good to move the joints. All right, to learn more, just go to hollymosier.com. We're gonna put a link on our EVB Live Facebook page. Breathe in, guys. <laughs> Tram, Tram, I'm stuck. Oh, you're stuck. Oh, oh, you need help. Oh, <laughs> Scott's now stuck. Now twist. Uh, uh, no. <laughs> Kim, Kim, I'll send Holly down. My downward dog is like a crippled dog. <laughs>
It's, it's, it's a three-legged dog. Right. Oh, I'll tell you what, being hunched over when we're editing or writing stories or what have you, it really takes a toll and so many times I feel so tight. But that was a great move. Yeah, just that back stretch yeah. is awesome. Because, this is my favorite. Like you said, though. we're at our desks like a lot of you all yeah. day long on our computers. Yeah, it really yeah. hurts. Good, Good stuff. stuff.